Hey guys, it's your inner chakras. Welcome back to my channel, guys. We are about to speak to your ancestors, so let's wake them up. I want them awaken, awaken. Let them wake up, right? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, guys, this is for the collective as always. We're going to take a peek into your relationship, right? We're going to let your ancestors take us in. They're going to sit us down on the couch, guys, and they're going to have a stern talk with us, okay? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, these are your past over loved ones. They can see things that you can't see, right? What's going on in your connection that you need? A little bit more information on, right? Let's just see. These are some big cards, guys. So I'm going to have to shuffle this way. Is it recording? Yeah, it is. All right. Ancestors, take us in. Sit us down. Let us see. Guys, you're about to get a bird's eye view of something. I don't know what. I'm going to do three, shuffle, and then three. Maybe I'm going to do four. <laughs> so, your ancestors are saying that your person... They're all up in their head about this connection. Like they don't, they don't know what to do. They feel trapped. During the Eight of Swords energy, this person feels trapped about this connection. They feel trapped about something. They feel maybe you two live at a distance. Maybe he can't get across that water to get to you. So this person, they're taking a knee. This is nine of wands in reverse. It's like they just stop moving. They just... Everything just stopped. They just, maybe they're not calling you as much, talking to you as much, texting you. It's like they stopped because this person is dealing with some karmic right now. They're dealing with some karmic energy. This is the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Maybe things aren't coming to them the way that they should or the way that they hoped. Your person, they're in a Five of Swords energy. It's like they're trying to walk away from these karmic energies but they're having a hard time it's like your person keeps going back to it it's like they walk away from it they go back to it during their five of swords energy in reverse so it's like they walk away and then they go and they reintroduce themselves back to the drama right it's almost like a codependent relationship they know they made bad choices but yet they go back to it right holy spirit holy angels let's see yeah this is the magician Let's see what the magician is doing. Prince of Swords. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. So this Prince of Swords, it looks like he's fighting against this Nine of Pentacles in reverse. It's like he's trying to get away from this karmic in reverse. But he doesn't know how to do so. So he's in hermit. He doesn't know how to get away from this karmic. So this person is really stuck up in their head, guys. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. They don't know how to get away. So, three of swords in reverse. So, they are, this this karmic air doesn't want this person to get away. But this person, they're trying to get away. They're fighting it, right? So, your person did, they, they are putting an ending to it, guys. They're in their chariot. So, this person is trying to get on. It's just that it could be an emperor in reverse. Somebody who doesn't have any control. Or somebody could be trying to control your, your masculine. But he's trying to move on in the Prince of Swords. Mm. 
Maybe they were controlling this masculine, right? But he ended up ending it and moving on. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors. Yeah, he ended it. He wants a new world, this person does. They have a lot of regrets on the choices they made. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. It seems like they ended a higher level of commitment because the Ace of Pentacles, that's like everything. That's all the Aces in one. But they ended it. They have regrets on who they married before or who they were with before. They have regrets on that. They want the new lovers here. They could be in love with someone else, guys. This could be you. This is a King of Pentacles in reverse. This person may still be married, guys. Your principles in reverse. He may still be married. But he wants the seven of pentacles with you. He wants this abundance with you. This person, it looked like they feel like they married the wrong person. However, they're in love with someone else. But this person may be married. Yeah, he wants to end that though. He wants, he wants to make that change. It's two of pentacles in reverse. He wants a union with you. He doesn't, either that or he doesn't want to juggle you between you and this marriage here. What is this spirit? Queen of Swords, yeah. He doesn't want to juggle you. Queen of Swords in reverse. He, was, he doesn't want to juggle you between you and the person that he's married to. A Queen of Swords in reverse. Right? Prince of Sacred Circles. They may have a child together. Ten of Wands, and that's your person's burden. Their burden is their children. Not that it's a burden, but yeah, the sun in reverse. It's like the karmic has everything that this person wants. It's only that the person doesn't want this everything with the person. Mm -hmm. It's like they married wrong. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. And like this person married wrong. You may be dating that um a man that's separated. Not divorced, but separated. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. He doesn't want to juggle you anymore. Too many burdens. Yep, here it is right here. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. He wants to get out of what he's in. They had family. They had connections. All of that together. He wants to get out of it. I told you this person could have been married. Here's the Princess of Sacred Circles. He sees you. He just can't get to you. Seven of Swords. He has to sneak his way back. He has to find a way to get to you. He has to find a way. Because he has a family back at home. Somewhere. Four Pentacles. So he's holding back. He doesn't want to give to anybody. Ace of Wands in reverse. He's uninspired. He's not happy where he is. Because he can't do anything but think about you, this high priestess. And he knows you know everything that's going on. He knows you know. He knows you know. He knows you know. King of Wands in reverse. He can't even talk to you about it. He's afraid. He knows this is a lot of injustice. Against you, the Princess of Swords. He knows this is wrong, the way that he's been treating you. He knows he's wrong. What else, ancestors? Six of swords. He's trying to find peace. He wants to swim away with coma waters. He wants to come to you. He wants the spirit cups with you. He wants to celebrate with you. He wants peace, temperance. Holy Spirit, holy angels.
What else ancestors? Four swords in reverse. He wants balance. He needs to heal from all of this. He wants to heal from all of this. This is judgment in reverse. This is your masculine refusing to make a decision in his life. In regards to this Queen of Wands here. He's refusing to make a decision. He's refusing to balance the scales. He's refusing to be fair and honest, right? He sees you as Princess of Cups. He knows you deserve his love. He does. You two may live at a distance, Eight of Wands. You probably be in a communication. He wants to come towards you fast. That's what the ancestor says. He's trying, right? He doesn't want to go back to his past. Six of Cups in reverse. And he's making a decision. He knows he needs to make a decision about that. Five of Wands. He's tired of fighting. He's tired of fighting. Maybe he's going to take a stand in his life, right? This is the tower in reverse. Maybe he's going to let things fall. The moon, too much has been revealed to this person. Two of Wands. This person wants a new partnership. He's waiting. The ancestor says this master, he wants this partnership with you guys. He wants a new partnership. Three of Wands in reverse. Yeah, he doesn't want to go back to that relationship. Ten of Swords. It was too much there. Too much backstabbing, too much everything. And then this is Six of Wands in reverse and no victory. Too much fighting, no victory. What else, ancestors? This is a clear reading for somebody. This person wants love. Ace of Cups with this Princess of Wands here. King of Swords in reverse. He's still up in his head. He's trying to figure out how to do it. All right? Seven of Cups. He has a lot of decisions to make, guys. One of his first decisions is he needs to end that hierophant. It's in reverse. He knows he needs to end that. And he wants a rebirth with you. He wants another chance with you. Death card in reverse. In order to do this, he's going to have to leave someone out in the cold. In order to get to this Queen of Cups here, this loving person, he has to leave someone out in the cold. And here's the King of Cups. There's a couple right there. He knows this is going to take strength, guys. Two of Cups. Love. The Devil. This masculine is getting away from the Devil, guys. So he can get to this Ten of Cups. I can't make it up, guys. That's your reading. From your ancestors. Your masculine is going through a lot of karma right now. Going to do doing some things. That's why they're not really in communication with you, talking with you, because they're they're doing some things. Your person could be married and you don't know it. Um, but your person, this is their judgment. They need to make a decision. Eventually, it is you two are a couple in the end. It's like the king and queen of cups. You do end up together eventually. I don't even know what to call this reading, guys, but be patient. I don't know. These masculines are going through it right now. A lot of them are leaving. Here we go again, guys. It's on the rampage. Masculines are scaling the walls. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Thank you, ancestors. Please like, share, and subscribe, guys. This is a good one. Peace.